At first glance, this is a typical early morning scene out in the bay in Cape Town. But these are not your average surfers. Using little more than their bodies in a wetsuit, boards nowhere to be seen, these are body surfers. Freedom. Absolute freedom. Just you and the surf. Figure out where you have to be, what you have to do, and just ride the wave, ride the, ride the ocean. It's, it's about being just you in the sea. It's great. Just a child, yeah? Just nothing serious about it. It's just fun. Some body surfers use small paddles in the water to better navigate a wave and stay stable. But in this strip back sport, you can never blame a bad session on the equipment. I think it's more about positioning, putting yourself in the right position to catch the wave and you're in the right position on the wave. Yeah. The simplicity of body surfing makes it a good bet for the oldest water gliding sport. From what we know, uh, you know, body surfing has a long history into pre-colonial Polynesian culture and even into pre-colonial African uh, culture, the coastal cultures, which have documented ships records when the Europeans were coming to do the early voyage of discovery and starting to trade along the west coast of Africa. When he isn't in the water, Quibis Yorbert makes surfboards, bodyboards and hand slides, the small paddles used by some body surfers. Even if they sell well, the market is small compared to classic surfing and big brands have no real interest in the sport. I think it's just that the, the big companies, the big corporates have not really discovered it. I think it's too basic, it's too simple. And in my words, it's too pure for them because there's too little product. There's too little probably profit for them to make. Body surfing remains a low key activity, far removed from the glamorous and trendy image of surfing. And that is exactly what Niels Havenhaar loves about it. He is the only surfer out on this reef for the day. I guess I've always liked it because there's less people do it. So it's not as crowded, it's easier. And it's safer. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Have you ever done it? You should. It's fun. <laughs>